Hey guys, what's going on? This is Tom in the Strength Agenda. We're giving you some training tips to make your athletes better, make yourself better. Today we're talking sled work. Here at the Strength Agenda for our sports performance program, we use sleds all the time to kind of mix it up on the days that we are working lower body. Some of the things we, uh, some of the reasons we use the sled is, like I said before, it gives you a little bit of variation on your leg day. Squats, deadlifts, and box jumps can be pretty boring, so we like to throw in different kinds of sled pulls to kind of change things up a little bit for our athletes. They also are to give, uh, give the joints a little bit of a break. You're not as much pounding with the deadlifts and the jumping and the squatting. And it also gets the athlete in a little bit more time under tension. What that means essentially is you are working longer, you're working harder. It works both the eccentric and the concentric portion of your range of motion. And then lastly, it just has a better carryover to your athletic performance. Gets a little bit more of a dynamic movement. You can move forward, backwards, side to side, and it'll just allow you to be a much better well-rounded athlete. So Derek's gonna take you through three variations that we use with our athletes here. Hopefully these help you out. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, please comment below. Let us know how you like this video and if there's any other variations that you use with your athletes. So the first exercise is the reverse sled drag. This is a great exercise for developing general leg strength and specifically targeting the posterior chain. There are three key points that we wanna make sure we're doing when performing this exercise. First, we want to stay nice and low. Typically, when people tend to get tired, they try to lean back and leverage the sled. Secondly, we want to push our chest up, allowing us to push through the ground. And lastly, we want to pull our shoulders back to properly engage the full posterior chain through the duration of this exercise. The second exercise we like to use is the lateral sled drag. This is a great explosive variation of a lateral lunge. Some key coaching points for this exercise are as follows. First, keeping the chest nice and high as we perform the exercise. Two, taking a slight step forward as you see here, allowing our body to fully lunge down and explode up. And third, making sure our step through is as explosive as possible. The last exercise is the forward sled march. This is a great exercise for developing explosive leg drive. You'll see here I'm driving my knee as high as possible while keeping my chest up. Typically athletes will try to bend at the waist in order to move forward as fast as possible. My goal here is to not move the sled, rather to drive my legs as fast and as explosive as I possibly can. 